Welcome everyone to Fantastic Frontier. We're gonna do a first impressions on this game. In this first impressions, we're gonna check out how the gameplay is, how the mechanics are, and of course how the graphics are. A lot of you recommended me actually trying out this game, and I can already say this lobby looks amazing. I can see they went with the Roblox smooth style building basically, and Roblox bricks, and everything is just smooth. Like there are basically three types of building, like smooth terrain, Roblox brick building with a lot of you know details in it and the smooth version of it anyway guys we're gonna press play and we're gonna hopefully have a character customization oh yes we do so let's see what we have so we have a couple of hairstyles going on over here we're gonna try to make a character that looks okay-ish because it doesn't really seem there is a lot of hairstyles so we have to be sure that we pick correctly so let's uh, first change the color to blonde here we go hmm what should I pick, to be honest? Because I'm not really a fan of this of these hairstyles. So we're just gonna flip. Okay, I think I have to go with this. So we have hair color and skin color. I'm not gonna change the skin color because I'm happy with the one I have right now. We're gonna press OK. And we are gonna spawn in. So let's see the first thing. Welcome to the Fantastic Frontier Tutorial. I will briefly cover the basics of how to play. Oh, that's interesting. I definitely want to know how to play this game. Okay. Oh my god, this is awesome. Here in Fantastic Frontier, you can earn gold by gathering collectibles and bringing them back to the town to sell. You can use gold to earn your s from selling to upgrade your character, equipment and tools. Awesome. The world is large and there are collectibles all over. Some collectibles may require a certain tool, such as a pickaxe, to be a harvest. Others can simply be picked up by straight from the ground. Oh, this is awesome! Along with plants, mushrooms and ore, there's always fish to catch and feathers to collect. You can keep track of the different collectibles you have collected in your temp... Itempedia. Oh my god, I didn't read that right. To open your itempedia, press the I key. Okay, okay, that's easy. I just have to remember that. I key. After you've earned some gold from selling collectibles, you can purchase new tools and equipment from the shops. To equip tools and equipment, open your inventory with the Q key. Then right-click the item in inventory and select equip. Okay, that's that's kind of easy. That's kind of easy. You may also want to purchase weapon and armor, for there are monsters in this land. Monsters are dangerous, and most will chase you if they see you. You will need to strong weapons to take down strong monsters. The strongest of weapons usually have special attack, which are, can be used by pressing the R button. Okay, okay, okay. Finding these monsters is not a fruit task. Monsters drop loot, which can also be sold for gold. The thought for that event, you may even seek out monsters to gain gold. Oh, wait, well, I just read it that double, I think, I don't know. Oh, let's see this. If you take damage while fighting monsters, you can heal up by eating food or resting. Food can be eaten in inventory by pressing the F key. You can rest in the end for a fee or own house. Okay, okay, that's handy. And having a house. If you do not heal and are killed, you will lose the items currently in your inventory along with the portions of your gold. Any tools and equipment you currently have equipped, however, are safe and will not be dropped on death. Oh, one last thing. Most areas of the map have uh, are safe being attacked by other players, but some few places are not and PvP combat is enabled. Be careful! Oh, PvP is in this game. That's awesome! Well, that's everything I have to tell you. Now get out there and play! Okay, I'm actually really hyped about this game because this looks amazing, so... Hi there! Okay, so we have the O button to open everything. We're gonna disable the music. Let's see if we have any other sounds. Okay, we do have any other sounds. I think this person thought he could, uh, you know, kill me. But you can't. You can't kill me right here. So, if you're wondering why am I playing on the Mustang World account, the reason for that was really simple. I basically signed in on this game for like a second and I forgot about that and then, you know, I ruined everything. But anyway, we're playing on this account for one episode and then I switch back to the normal one. So, let's just go. Hi there! Need some help? Please don't mind the hair. I got a fat armor weapons. 
If you're looking for weapons, you should look right in the town square. There's lots of melee weapons, ranged, and magic. Okay, okay, as an armor, there's an armor smith who has a shop near the castle, heads up the road, past the graveyards. Okay, 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 okay. Thanks. That will be all. Okay. So we have a smithy. Hi there. Greetings. Looking for something sharp? Show me what you have. These are expensive. These are really expensive. Okay, bronze scimitar. A quick and powerful skim skimmy meter. 14 damage. If I said the name wrong, I'm sorry. An elegant rapier capable of poking launch attacks. Mm, I'm gonna go with a bronze rapier. Probably want that. Okay, okay, okay. So now we press Q. Equip that. So what do we? How do we do that? Oh, equip. And then, we already had a sword, I didn't even notice. I just noticed that we already started with a sword. But you know, you know, we, we got two now, and I appreciate that. Let's see, we got more people around here. The game itself looks awesome. It actually has a little bit of a feeling of, you know, other games. I don't know what it's called anymore, but the graphics are quite amazing. Oh my god, that's a giant piggy. Hey there, Mr. Piggy. Oink, oink. <laughs> Uh, smooth terrain as well. That's really interesting that they went for the smooth terrain combo. But probably worth it. It takes a little bit of time to master smooth terrain probably. But it's worth it. It's worth it. Hello there. Hi there. Wanderer. Nothing. You know, that's kind of rude. It's kind of rude that you don't want to talk to me. Okay, you are Mr. Orange Hat. That sounded scary. Okay. Hi there. Skills go a long way in the battlefield, but if you struck it's a real monster. Uh, of course you upgrade daily, but I wasn't searching for that. I was searching for the blacksmith. Oh, he's probably inside here, the armor smith, man. I definitely want to go um, buy an armor if I still can. I can only. Go I'm gonna go for a chest plate. Reason's probably quite obvious. Chest plates are big. Uh oh. Uh, why is the drop button in the beginning? Why not just the other one? Okay, here we go. Oh, yeah, we are set. We're probably gonna be the most OP people in the world game. We're gonna wreck you all. So, you know, you just better prepare for yourself. I am coming here to wreck you. You know? I don't know. I'm probably gonna die off really quickly. So, let's just go adventure outside. So, I wonder if that's fall damage. Please, no. Yeah, no fall damage. Okay. Let's just go venture outside. We're gonna turn up the volume a little bit. I don't know if the music is copyrighted. If somebody can check that out, I would be much appreciated if I know who the music maker is. Because I would like to know that. Because I'm currently just playing my own music in the background. If you may be here, if I don't forget to edit it in. You know, it's just, it's just, it's just a thing, just, you know. Okay, these trees are simple. Like, everything looks simple. At the same time, it isn't. You know? Hello? What happens if I turn on, uh... Music? Right, one. Ah, uh, nothing really. Nah, I'm not gonna turn it on then. Uh, we're gonna keep on the bloom effect, because, you know, why not? Why not? Um... Let's see... Everything is kinda... Quiet! Oh, I just said quiet. Oh. Hello? Okay, interesting. I don't know where you came from. But I don't appreciate it. I'm probably gonna die. Harvest. Woo! I harvested something. Okay. Read sign. Okay, 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 okay. Awesome. Uh, no first person, sadly enough. Is there a map in this game, or do I have to learn the map by myself? Because I am actually scared that I would walk in towards a zone for play killers at my level. I will be scrapped if I do that. I will be so dead if I go to a PvP area. But let's just adventure. 
And maybe we're gonna find something awesome because this game is just awesome. I can already say, fun wise, it's getting there. You just have to probably go inside back in the spawn area and just go there, you know, talk with people and blah, 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 blah. You know, for quest. Uh, mechanics are quite easy, simply made, zombie noise, uh, enemies, easy, easy, but still nice to have. Um, graphics, awesome, 10 out of 10. It's simple, yet it's there. You know, it's noticeable. So let's just climb this mountain and let's see where it brings us. What are you? What? Are you hostile? Hi there. Oh, you are definitely hostile. Hiya! Oh, no, no, he doesn't die! Ah! Ah! No, 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 I didn't mean any harm! I didn't mean to do that! 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 I don't wanna die yet! I don't wanna die yet! We're gonna go back, we're gonna go back to town! And we're just gonna play the game how we're supposed to play it, okay, guys? But anyway, if you want to see more in the future, I'm gonna do a little bit of off-screen farming, maybe. Depends what you guys want to. I'm gonna switch back to my main account. You know, buy the right weapons in the beginning, because I don't think I bought the right stuff in the beginning. And, yeah. This game is worth it. Link is down in the description, so please, everyone, say it with me. And, oh my god, that dude is awesome! Okay, anyway. Everyone, please say it with me. One, two, three. Peace out. Yeah!